Hello and a very warm welcome. Toyota set to return to Formula 1. Toyota return to Formula 1 as they sign a multi-year technical partnership with Haas F1. Toyota, one of the best liveries of all time. The red and white Panasonic livery is up there with one of the best. And Toyota, I believe, are a fan's favourite kind of team. But yeah, they will be returning to Formula 1, not as a team, but they will feature on the Haas car. Um, yes, this news was announced today at Toyota's home, like track, Fuji. Toyota Gazoo Racing, they've obviously had a lot of success in World Endurance. Um, the likes of Kamui Kobayashi. Toyota returned to F1 as they signed multi-year technical partnership with Haas. Toyota are returning to Formula 1 for the first time since 2009. Yeah, and this will begin immediately. So at Austin, we will see Nico Hulkenberg and Kevin Magnussen's car with the Toyota sponsor on. Uh, yeah, we will see it. Um, I've got a picture of it. Oh, not that one, sorry. Uh, this one. Yes, so we will see the Haas covered in the Toyota logos, which is quite cool to see. Yes, so let's get into it. The Japanese manufacturer spent eight seasons in Formula 1 as a works team and engine supplier scoring 13 podiums and achieving a best finish of fourth in the constructors. As part of the multi-year agreement, Haas and Toyota, through their motorsport and R&D division, Toyota Gazoo Racing, will share expertise and knowledge, as well as resources. Yes, the deal will run alongside their arrangement with Ferrari, whom Haas have worked with since they entered the sport in 2016. Toyota Gazoo Racing will provide design, technical and manufacturing services to Haas, while Haas will offer technical expertise and commercial benefits in return. I mean, it works. It's quite a shock, this announcement. I'd love to see Toyota come back as a team, uh, like full time, but yeah, uh, quite a bit of a shock that they've chose Haas. Um, yeah, the aim is for Haas to improve their development and competitive standing within the sport, with Toyota developing their own knowledge and skills through F1. Ayo Komatsu, I'm hugely excited that Moneygrass, Moneygram Haas F1 and Toyota have come together to enter into this technical partnership. To have a world leader in the automotive sector support and work alongside our organisation while seeking to develop and accelerate their own technical and engineering expertise, it's simply a partnership that benefits <clears throat> both outfits. Yeah, I'm losing my voice, Jesus. <clears throat> In return, we offer a platform for Toyota Gazoo Racing to fully utilise and subsequently advance their in-house engineering. Yeah. So, Haas F1. Now, obviously, they're going with a brand new lineup uh, next year. It's exciting times for Haas F1. Yeah. The deal was announced at Toyota-owned Fuji International Speedway on Friday, and we will see Toyota Gazoo Racing branding visible on both Haas cars at Austin. So yeah, um, this is a photo of them today, uh, obviously announcing this. MoneyGram Haas F1, official technical partner, and we're going to see the branding on the car which is going to be very good. Comment down below your thoughts. Second video of the day, uh, we're covering more F1 in this one. Haas are currently 7th in the Constructors Championship, just 3 points adrift of racing balls. That's going to be a titanic scrap. It's worth millions of pounds, 6th or 7th, racing balls or Haas. It's worth millions of pounds. Nico Hulkenberg, Kevin Magnussen, can they overturn this gap or is Lawson and Sonoda could be fireworks there can they hold on to six 
it's going to be interesting to see what happens. Obviously, Nico Hulkenberg will go to Audi. Kevin Magnussen's future is probably done. Oli Behrman and Esteban Ocon will come in. But this is huge. To see the Toyota name back in Formula 1 is going to be great to see and see how this progresses. They've had massive success in world endurance. Um, yeah, at the likes of Le Mans, world endurance, winning title, title, you know, with the hypercars, the LMP1s, you know, Kamui Kobayashi, um, obviously Japanese man, uh, former F1 driver. Comment down below your thoughts on this news. Um, yeah, so Toyota returned to F1 having signed a partnership with Haas.